What up, everybody? Given everything that's been going on lately in the world with the Israel, uh, Hamas terror stuff, the Hamas calling for the global jihad, where you had the uh, the stabbing in France where a teacher was killed, the riots and protests that you have going on, now more than ever, it's really important that you have your own first aid pouch. This is my ouch pouch. Because in the end, you were your own first responder. You're the first one on scene when somebody, when you get hurt. Because you, it's you getting hurt. You need to be able to at least give yourself some sort of first aid to get it started. So we're going to go through my, uh, my pouch. And we'll see. I keep this in my truck. All times. I always have, you know, it's within wherever my truck is compared to me. All right. Main compartment. And this is just one of those, like, little generic military backpacks you get off of eBay or whatever. All right. Number one. Have a cat tourniquet. Have a cat tourniquet. Yes, a whatever kind of tourniquet is better than no tourniquet at all. If you have the money... Spend a little extra, get yourself a cat one. I've got some ABD uh, dressings, those for large wounds, soaking up and everything like that. Got some triangle uh, bandages for some uh, slings and whatnot, and some paper tape. I love paper tape. Paper tape's like the greatest thing. It doesn't really stick to your, uh, to your skin that bad, but it sticks good enough for dressings and whatever, especially if you have... Uh, Elderly people who have like paper thin skin, it doesn't tear their skin off. You want to have a pair of trauma shears. This here is like a just a really quick first aid kit. I've uh, got a pair of gloves, a couple of little two by two gauzes, some band aids, and a couple of alcohol things. Just basically a quick little uh, scratch or whatever. Nothing fancy. Going to the outside pocket. We got a bunch of uh, four by fours, and then just various bandages. And then finally, in my little pouch, got a couple rolls of uh, small Curlex and some more alcohol pads. Nothing fancy. No, I'm not going to be uh, saving every single person. This is really just a one, maybe two person quick thing. This is not meant to be a medic bag or anything like that. This is a first responder for yourself or those immediately around you that something has happened. I always make sure I have this, especially when I'm at the range because bullets going in people sucks. And, you know, when seconds count, everybody's minutes away. But yeah, so get your own ouch pouch. If you don't already have one, just carry something. And if I'm missing anything in your opinion, let me know. Otherwise, talk to y'all here later.